compared to 65.5% uh, of Microsoft and then 22.5% of Firefox. Uh, my, the market share is not impressive and in no way could you consider Google to be dominant right now. Uh, right here we have a uh, the market share by category as you can see Microsoft owns a lot of the browser share and then also the office suite they have um, nearly all of it and then web searches for Google but as we said earlier it's kind of going down their advertisements online and stuff is decreasing. Any questions? I have a question. Um, do you think that Google will be able to compete with Microsoft in the future? Um, as you can see by that, it doesn't appear that it is with the 2% share, but maybe if they can uh, develop some more innovative ways that maybe are better than Microsoft, then maybe it will catch on Google start even in that out a little bit. I mean, they also, I mean, if you think about it, they have to, uh, I mean, how many of you guys have even heard of Google Chrome OS? Does anybody use it? Use it? I, Operating I, I, system. You do? I, I downloaded it the other day. Okay. Um, but I mean, if you, I mean, like, there's only a couple people that raise their hands. I think Google needs to get their name out there more for the operating system, and that would be a way to start bumping up their sales. So Google is now becoming a like Office suite, kind of like Microsoft Word almost. Yeah. Those they're developing those things, and mm -hmm. it's not just a search engine anymore. Right. What does OS stand for? Operating system. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why do you think uh, CEO of Google, Eric Schmidt, hates Microsoft so much? Why does he go after like Apple and everything? He's such a hater of Microsoft. Is that the other success possible? Yeah, they've edited against the 